Today, I'm doing something for the first time. I'm meeting one of you in real life. I'm driving to New Jersey to meet Q. She's been following me on YouTube for years. She's been a student in my academy and I can't wait to meet her. Come on this adventure with me. I had such a fun day with Q. You guys are gonna love meeting her. Part of meeting Q and making this video here today for you is also to announce that today starts my spring sale of Rachel's English Academy. You can get your first month for just $5. Sale ends Sunday. Now, I'm gonna be talking to you about the Academy throughout this video, and I hope by the end you love it and you will absolutely come join me there. All right, let's head. Head is short for head out, which means to leave. I scoot my chair up, buckle in. Okay, here's the thing about me and driving. I hate it, I detest it, I am no good at it. Maybe you've seen the video where I blew out a tire because I was trying to make a video while driving like I am now. Um, but I have to do it. Actually, David was going to come, he was going to drive me, and then he got COVID. Okay, here's what's very annoying about my neighborhood. The mail truck is just stopped in the middle of the street. It's just stopped there. Everyone behind it just has to wait. Let's take a picture. So when the mail delivery person is done, we get to start going again. I think the reason why I hate driving is because there was a period of time, many years where I didn't have to drive. I lived in Boston, I lived in New York City and I just got bad at it. I got out of practice. If you're out of practice, this is something that requires skill and you haven't done it for a while. Maybe you're playing golf for the first time in several months and you're not doing well. You could say, man, I'm really out of practice. While I'm driving to New Jersey, let me show you what students get in the academy and why it can help you. There are thousands of hours of video and audio content here, but don't worry, I have a daily plan for you so you don't need to waste any time deciding what to study or what order to use for the lessons. These lessons are based on what works to get students to hear English in a new way and change their habits. Leave the sounds, rhythms, and placement of their native language behind. It's not intellectual. It's a body, ear, voice-based approach. You see, I was an opera singer years ago. This is me in a production of Madama Butterfly at the Boston Lyric Opera. If you want to hear a clip of me singing opera, I'll play one at the end of this video. I sing all sorts of roles in various languages, and let's just say I learned a thing or two about the voice and how physical changes change the sound. Also, the joy in the repetitive work of getting a new role, a new character into my voice so I could sing that character with ease. This is the background that I bring to my lessons in the academy. You learn information in a video, and then you work with the audio to transform your own voice. You've learned what makes American English sound American, and now you give your body the opportunity to find that sound. The audio, regular pace and slow motion. The audio lets you work with repetition to change your habits, so you can stop doing the double work of thinking what to say and how to say it. You won't have to think about your pronunciation anymore because you'll have it locked in the habit. I call it the play it, say it method. This is what my student Alex said about it. But you sound great. Thank you so much. So that's um, because of Rachel's English. I learned <laughs> a lot and uh, started a lot of courses. Uh, that awesome. method, um, uh, play and say it, uh, play and say it method. So it's just awesome. But first of all, uh, when I heard about it, I. I hate it. I thought, what's like, I don't want I know. to do it. But I then know. I started to do it, and that's just awesome. And I'm continuing uh, doing it till this day. So that's, that's great. That's awesome. So and I'm so, so glad to hear that because I know it's like people, when people learn what it is, they're like, oh, I don't want to do that. And I've had so many people yeah. say, I started the academy and I thought, I'm too advanced for this. And then when I actually started doing it, I realized how much I was changing and tweaking and how much better I was sounding. 
And so I'm glad that you had that. Thank you for sharing with everybody because other people here might be having that initial reaction too. Like, oh, this repetition, this isn't boring. That's the most this important. Yes, yeah, so I this know. Is and it's the major thing. And it's what just lets your body find it. And that's what's going to make it natural for yourself in conversation. So thank you for sticking with it and pushing through that. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. There are so many details to the American accent, and we cover them all. This is likely the first time you'll ever be working this way with this method, and you won't be doing it alone. We have a community where you can post videos and get feedback from a teacher. This is personalized feedback just for you. We also have something called office hours every week where you can show up and chat with teachers to ask your questions, and we provide very thorough support through email. You will not be alone on this journey. We'll take you through all the sounds, the rhythm, the melody, and the placement. You'll learn vocabulary, phrasal verbs, and idioms. We have a course that goes over all of the 500 most common words in English. I want to share what my student Joel said. So in the time I've spent working with Rachel's English Academy, I have seen a huge improvement with my pronunciation. The way I speak English, the way I understand English, and the way I feel the language just feels completely different now than it felt just a few months ago before I started working with the Academy. Getting feedback from the teachers, working with all the courses, imitating the conversations, which are really great because you get a lot of audio and a lot of materials to imitate real conversations between native speakers. And that's really amazing. That has really helped me to get a better accent and most important to feel more comfortable when I speak English and to feel confident with the way I speak English. So I would definitely recommend Rachel's English Academy to anyone who's trying to get a better pronunciation and to improve their accent because it has really worked for me. After working with things like placement and stress, which are concepts that I had no idea of before joining the Academy, but have a really big impact in your pronunciation when you start working with them. That has really helped me to get a better pronunciation, which is everything that I ever wanted to speak a little bit more clear and to be able to be understood by native speakers. And that's something that the Academy has helped me to achieve. So I would definitely recommend Rachel's English Academy to anyone who has the same goals, because the Academy can really help you if you're willing to put in some time to practice every day. I love this, but it didn't happen overnight for Joel. Joel dedicated his time to this learning, this habit training. Bravo, Joel, for your effort. You sound absolutely amazing. Please check us out and see if we can't help you find your American voice and transform your spoken English. It's just $5 to start rachelsenglishacademy.com this week only. People do get results. My student Tom said this, I currently live in Toronto. I've been with the Academy for 13 months and tried to practice at least one hour each day. My boss recently told me that my pronunciation has improved substantially and I was promoted to assistant vice president at the beginning of this year. I love the real results and increased confidence my students get. Okay, so let's see if I made it to New Jersey. Okay, I made it to New Jersey. No accidents. Let's go find Q. Q picked this really cute little spot in New Jersey where we sat on a heated patio and had views of the lake and flowers. Hello. I have decided on that salad that you yeah. talked about with uh, no, no meat additions. Okay. Yeah. And I'm going to just stick with water for today. When you say you're going to stick with something, that means you're going to keep using what you have. You're not going to choose anything else or anything in addition. I didn't order another drink. I said I was going to stick with the water that I already had on the table. Or let's say someone asked you if you're thinking about changing jobs. You could say, no, I'm going to stick with my current position for at least one more year. I coach students live in the academy every month, and I can get to know students through our community group. But getting to meet a student in real life was such a treat. She had great suggestions for how to make the academy better, and I always love thinking about ways to improve the student experience. 
One thing I can tell you right now is that the Academy is not a magic solution. The students who succeed are the students who set aside time to train with the method and the material most days. Are you motivated to do the work? What goals might you reach with better spoken English? Don't worry, I make sure the work is worth it. You will see results. Then I ordered tea and dessert. I would like the white peony. Okay. And which, which dessert do you think is the best here? Peony is my favorite flower, so I was guessing I would love the tea. What kind of bread pudding? Lemon. Mm. I always love to ask the servers at restaurants what they like on the menu. Sometimes it gets me to order things I wasn't considering. Is that your favorite? Okay. I'll have that. Thank you. Thank you. After dessert, Q and I walked around the gardens and got some pictures with the sculptures. Then we sat down and I got to hear more about her experience in the U.S. and improving her English. Q is a high school teacher and she's getting a master's degree. What made you sign up for the Academy in the first place? Most importantly is I have lo those thoughts, a lot of thoughts that I would like people to get it in mm. English. Right. So communication. Yeah, I totally get that. Mm. So people can understand me easier and better and uh, definitely have more confidence while I'm talking to people. Mm -hmm. Which is so important at work, right? Yes. Not only to work, but also to you know, like everyday lives as yeah, well. Right, social life too. Yes, I, my native language Chinese quite choppy. So sometimes I have to remind myself to say it very slow and put everything together mm -hmm. in an American way. That took me for a while, but again, definitely worth it. So every time before a interview or some important meeting, I will do the placement exercise. Mm -hmm. Like on the way here today, I was doing oh, uh -huh. while driving, <laughs> and I was talk to myself a lot. <laughs> and I love how you said that it does take time, but it it's worth it because it's totally true. People who don't put in time don't really get anything out. So you do have to commit to putting the time in, but then you get those rewards. Yes. You can only access the Academy courses, teacher feedback through the community, live classes with me, and the teacher office hours through a subscription. With this subscription, you're automatically charged every month. And after your $5 first month, the price goes up to the regular price of $37 a month. But I wanna stress, you can cancel at any time. We also offer a 30-day money-back guarantee. So if you don't think this method works for you, just email us within the first 30 days, letting us know you'd like a refund and we'll process that for you. Drop any questions you have in the comments. The whole support, not only about, you know, the academy-wise, but also it's the emotion support that you we have a community that we can grow together and you know that all those teachers and classmates and people in the community are there so i love like, that you feel that i do i feel like i'm not alone that's awesome it's like, very important to us that people i don't know feel seen that they feel a part of something yes in the academy you can find a lot of interesting people just like you and when those people are together, it's a, such a nice group and community and connection. Q and I are hoping to have another meetup sometime soon, this time with other students from the Academy. Also, this is amazing. Q has her own YouTube channel where she teaches Chinese. She made this to supplement her classroom. I love this. Follow her links in the video description. I promise do the opera, here's the opera. This is ancient, before it was so easy to get a good audio recording, and so it's recorded on a little audio device during a rehearsal when I was in graduate school.
If you've seen this opera before, let me know in the comments. If you have any questions about the Academy, drop them in the comments. Thanks for watching. I love being your English teacher. That's it, and thanks so much for using Rachel's English.